As all the thoughts and memories of that fateful day flood our minds and hearts, may we choose today to honor all the brave men and women who ran to land aid and rescue those in harm's way. A little more than uh, one year ago, this was only a vision. Once we built our new station, we were like, this is a beautiful place to have a monument to remember the 9-11 events. Great support from the citizens and, and the city. It was just amazing. It's a beautiful ceremony, beautiful service, and I'm just so proud to have had a small part in bringing this beautiful monument to our town. Dunedin is such a, a great community and it's such a close-knit community and to see so many people come out to the unveiling of, of this new memorial that was designed by someone who lives right here in Dunedin to celebrate the, the lives that were lost on 9-11 on uh, was truly a, a special event. Just incredibly proud of this community uh, for, for taking the time for the turnout uh, to support this incredible event. Uh, it's a beautiful memorial that will be a constant reminder to us all about how great this country is and how hard we have to work to protect it. It is hard to believe that 15 years have passed since that horrible day when terrorists attacked the World Trade Center. I would venture to say every member of the New York City Fire Department, whether active or retired, knew somebody who uh, perished that day. It is important that the public always remembers the sacrifices made by these brave men and women in performing their duties and protecting life and property for the citizens they serve. I'm really pleased to have been here today because I was so excited to see this piece of the World Trade Center in our community now. It was so nice to see so many people here today and support it. Hopefully you will come by and take a look at it and spend a few moments and read the inscription there. It's really beautiful. It's important because we can never forget what happened to us on 9-11 and the first responders who gave their lives to save others and we can never forget. We have to remember that and our children and Every generation needs to be reminded of the day we were attacked.